that was a terrible ending. Um, what a complete meltdown by the Kings on that final offensive possession. Let's talk about it. Final score from New Orleans, 117-112. to 112. The Kings were down as many as 17 points in this game. They came back and they took the lead by a point late in the fourth quarter. And then it just went back and forth, back and forth. And um, they just did not finish the game. They had this game right there. It was there for the win. They should have won this game tonight, and they didn't get it done, man, down the stretch. So, Monica Sabonis in uh, 36 minutes tonight, 23 points, 9 boards, 6 assists. Harrison Barnes, 41 minutes. He had 22 points, 3 boards, 1 uh, – I'm excusing, 3 rebounds, 0 assists. De'Aaron Fox, 38 minutes. He had 26 points, 5 assists. He had 2 rebounds. Kevin Herter had uh, 8 points in 27 minutes. He had 2 assists and 7 rebounds. Chris Duarte started for Keegan Murray tonight. Keegan Murray was ruled out for uh, without uh, a lower back uh, soreness, and uh, hopefully it's nothing major for Keegan. Um, but Duarte got to start for him. And in 20 minutes, Duarte had six points. He had two assists, one rebound. Let's take a look at the bench. Trey Lyles, welcome back, Trey Lyles. Loved what I saw from Trey Lyles tonight. 28 minutes, he had 12 points, eight boards. Uh, Sasha Vizenkov, 10 minutes tonight, he had three points. He was one of five overall from the field, and he had two boards. Uh, Kessler Erber got a minute tonight. He had zero points. JaVale McGee had, McGee had five minutes tonight. He had zero points, one rebound, zero assists. Davion Mitchell had 10 minutes tonight. He had two points from the free throw line. And Malik Monk got 26 minutes tonight. He was one of six uh, from beyond the arc, two of eight overall, and he had 10 points. And he had five assists and two steals and four rebounds. Um, Slauson, Kobe Jones, and Petra Zaviv did not play. That was Mike Brown's uh, DMP tonight. But... Uh, let's talk about the fourth quarter. Harrison Barnes down the stretch had, they run a play for Harrison Barnes coming out of a timeout. He takes a contested three and I felt like he should have never took that shot. I get the fact that Mike Brown's all about taking the best shot available on that possession. That wasn't the best shot available. We had time on the clock. I felt like we rushed that shot and I think that he definitely could have kicked it out and we could have got a better shot than that. What he shot from the corner. Then the very next offensive possession, he passes up a wide open three uh, to De'Aaron Fox, who takes a contested three, and De'Aaron Fox missed that three pointer, unfortunately. And um, that was pretty much the game. So Harrison Barnes, I mean, I hate to put it on Harrison Barnes, but because Harrison Barnes played a good basketball game tonight, he was fantastic. He actually was the big reason. Him and Trey Lyles, they were the big reasons why the Kings got back in this game in the fourth quarter. Um, really, really good to see Harrison Barnes play good basketball, but man, those two offensive possessions, HB, oh man, I just, uh, wish they would have not gone the way they did in those two possessions. Um, and then after that offensive, uh, after that Darren Fox miss, uh, Barnes gets clipped on the Zion screen. They didn't call an offensive foul on Zion. Of course they didn't call it because Zion Williamson that freed up Brandon Ingram to go down, uh, and get a layup. Ingram uh, puts his elbow on Sabonis' face. Another game, another elbow to Sabonis' face. And, of course, they don't call him an offensive foul on Bender Ingram because he's Bender Ingram. And that was pretty much the game. Um, but the meltdown was after Ingram made a layup, we took so much time off the clock. Like, Fox, what are you doing? Barnes, what are you doing? We got too passive. Like, the shot clock's against us. We need to get a shot off. We wasted so much time. And I felt like that possession cost us the game. Fox finally makes the layup and there's like 0.8 left. But you're down three points. You're down three points. We quickly foul them. Pelicans make two free throws and that's a ball game. Um, very frustrating. Very, very frustrating. And uh, a terrible letdown by the Kings. A meltdown, should I say, on that possession. And especially the, the two possessions as well. This, just the last three possessions of the game was a complete meltdown. Um... You know, this team got to do better. I mean, you got to do better, man. Give Pelicans credit. They made us pay down the stretch. Um, you know, anytime you have a Zion Williamson and a Banner Ingram, uh, you're going to be you're going to you're going to be tough to beat. And they executed down the stretch. I just felt like we got back in the game and we could have potentially won this game tonight and we didn't get it done. We didn't get it done down the stretch. Um, you know, they those two got it done. And despite not getting those calls, the Kings screwed up those possessions. 
uh, that contested corner three pointer by Harrison Barnes. And he passed up the wide open three and gave it to De'Aaron Fox for a contested three pointer. And then the last possession offensively, I don't know what the hell we were doing there. Um, it's like we helped the Pelicans burn up a lot of time off the clock. And then Fox, instead of taking a three, he takes a two and he makes it. But you're still down by three. So I don't know what we we're doing there. Um, maybe they got locked like Dizzle, but it is what it is, man. Just lost today is our second straight loss to the Pelicans. Um, thank God we are done playing the Pelicans because they're just a team that's long and lengthy and they present nightmare and mismatches with their two stars. And, um, you know, I'm really, I like the fact that we got back in this game. I just was hoping that it wasn't going to be another blowout. Like we had the two blowouts in Houston. Um, I knew that we were just not gonna let that happen. And, you know, we got back in this game, but despite those last three possessions, I love the way we played, especially in the fourth quarter. You know, uh, Trey Lyles came in, hit some big threes. Monk hit a big three. Our bench got it done tonight. Our bench really did get it done tonight. Uh, it's just a damn shame that uh, we just screwed up on those last three possessions of the game. And uh, we let the Pelicans execute down the stretch. So uh, with that being said, we are now three and two on this road trip. You're eight and six. Uh, you got a tough, tough team on Friday. I mean, you guys thought tonight was ten, uh, tough. Make no mistake about it. Friday's game in Minneapolis, it's an in-season tournament game against a very good Timberwolves team who are on top of the conference right now. It's going to be 10 times tough because they got size and length and they are a mass a mismatch and they are, they are a nightmare as well. They got a very good basketball team. This Sacramento Kings team better be ready to play Friday because um, that's going to be a real test. That's going to be actually a measuring stick on where you're at early on the season so far. And I'm looking forward to seeing how this team responds. We have the talent to get it done. We have the talent to get it uh, bounced back from this loss and go into Minnesota and beat them. Let's get it done. Let's get back on track. Let's get some more wins. That's going to do it for you for tonight's video. I really do appreciate you guys tuning in. Of course, as always, let me know your guys' comments in the section. Uh, let me know your guys' thoughts in this comment section below. If you guys celebrate, I want to wish you guys all a wonderful Thanksgiving and a safe holiday holiday tomorrow. Enjoy it with your family, loved ones, and or friends. And um, I hope that the Kings uh, will be able to bounce back Friday against in Minneapolis against the Timberwolves. So with that being said, that's going to do it for today's video. You guys take care. God bless. Keep pushing forward. I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace.